good <laughs> good morning of all good mornings it is now saturday of my glastonbury trip if you haven't seen all the rest of my days then watch the previous video on my channel and um, we're going back home tomorrow which is very sad but today should be good because today is one of the main reasons why we decided to come here and that is to see the big glastonbury um um carnival but all i can smell right now is breakfast so i think my dad's made breakfast downstairs and that makes me incredibly excited so thanks dad if you're watching this video you're not watching this video yesterday we went christmas shopping um and i will have to show you the um shirt i got my sister kate so we were both supposed to be christmas shopping for other people um and then we kept like picking things up that we really liked for ourselves next minute i was like okay we're supposed to be shopping for other people why don't we just buy the clothes that we picked out for each other and so that's what we decided to do <laughs> Whoa! Good morning! Hi. Hello folks! Ooh! Hello! Hello! You like that blue light, don't you? This is an amazing shot, isn't it Kate? Yeah! Look! It's like everywhere you go, there are things to look at. Look at these pillows, cushions, and this door. How cool is that? Yeah. Look at this. And this one. Imagine this being your house. Morning, guys. Just lighting up the fire. Is my jacket. <laughs> it's so colourful. We're having a spot of lunch before we prep for the big <laughs> carnival. It is called a carnival, isn't it? Yeah. I keep wanting to call it something else. I don't know what. Festival. Fe yeah, I keep wanting to call it a festival. It's not a festival. So it's only... It's what time is it now? Oh. Is that what it's called? Illumination Carnival. Maybe we should bring like 3D glasses or something. <laughs> Enhance the vibes. Um, <laughs> they probably sell them there. Probably. But you must sell, buy them from their own people. You should okay. have brought some glow sticks and sold them. Yeah. <laughs> I've got loads of glow sticks to be fair at home. Anyway. <laughs> what time is it? It's like nearly four. It doesn't start until six something. Mm. Seven maybe. And it's already pretty busy down there. So we've come back to have Kate add some warm cider. Oh, you've drunk it all? Okay, <laughs> Kate's drunk all her. I'm having a cold cold one with the lads <laughs> cloudy thatcher's haze and i wanted to show you what i bought oh what's dad having red wine it's a red mum's having her veggie sausage roll i haven't eaten mine yet i got a veggie sausage roll from burns, burns the bakery you guys got real sausage rolls you murderers <laughs> <laughs> bedtime tea they did like a big fat aisle of different types of tea. So I got the one that makes you sleepy and it's got vanilla in it. I got garlic granules for Adam to bring back. <laughs> Cause he's the king of garlic. And popcorn pie chocolate. This probably tastes not very nice cause it's raw chocolate. Mm. No offense to vegans out there. <laughs> I've tried vegan chocolate before, it's a bit weird. But yeah, I chose it cause he loves popcorn. Specially salted popcorn. Are we excited for the carnival? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I was saying that was day to do it with you, these shots make you sleepy, going around with all that incense stuff. Yeah. If you shop in Brighton, it wakes you up because like people are milling around and there's like lots going on, but here it's like incense sticks and 
colors well, and calm people. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's another thing I wanted to show you. Look at the barcode. It's, I mean, I guess that's just a fake part of the barcode, right? Yeah. That's really cool though. I watched a video about how barcodes work, by the way. Mm -hmm. It was very fascinating. Like every single number does a certain thing and companies have to pay for a long barcode if you pay for a short one, but mm -hmm. it means you can only sell up to a certain amount of things in your shop because it only takes up yeah, like two bits of, buy things in. as in a brand, if yeah. you're buying a brand. What did you get, Mum? Never worry or have any fear, as your guardian angel is always near. She shines a light to guide you home. With her by your side, you are never alone. Mm. Aww. This is Ellie's review on Burns sausage roll from Glastonbury. <laughs> well, for starters, it's not cheese and onion. And I hate when they say veggie sausage roll and it's just cheese and onion. Does anyone agree? Yes. Not very adventurous. It's real meat alternative. Are you zooming in on my face? No. <laughs> I've been very professional. Is it just not any sausage roll? It's Burns <laughs> Glassbury sausage roll. It's really good. It no, tastes like that real sausage. Let's zoom it in. <laughs> so, what's your overall? How many stars out of 10? Nine. Okay. What okay. about the pastry out of 10? Um, <laughs> it might be better if I ate it when it was warm. Okay. Eight. Okay, what about the texture of the meatiness? Eight. Oh, there okay. we so go. It just needs to be a bit fatter. Okay. <laughs> a bit flat and nice. It's like a mouth. No, I need to be fatter. <laughs> There you go, that's the overall review. Here is the shirt I wanted to show you that I got Kate. Look! It's Tinkerbell as a punk little fairy woman thing. I think I got something from them before, last time I came here. Um, it's a brand called Twisted. It's basically like alternative characters. But yeah, Kate wanted this one, so I've got it for you for Christmas, haven't I? Yeah. I won't show you what she got me yet because I'm not allowed to look at it, although she's looking at hers, so stop looking, Kate. <laughs> I think last year I got uh, Elsa and Anna taking a selfie, but they're like gothic and all, they look all cool and stuff. Um, and I got that on a little vest top and I gave it to Vicky for Christmas. We've made it to our location. We've got all our hats on. Mum, show your hat. The Grinch. <laughs> Dad's got his fisherman hat on. Kate's got a farmer's hat. I've just got my olive hat. And we're waiting for the carnival behind us. So it's going to come through this way, obviously, isn't it? Yeah. It's going to come down here and all the way up there in about 20 minutes. And it's a bit rainy and it's forecasted heavy rain. But but true Brits, we're here. Yeah true British troops with umbrellas. Yeah, and it's raining, so I'm gonna put my camera away. <laughs> we are waiting, we are waiting in the rain. The sea. What's that song about waiting? Why are we waiting? Why are we waiting? Waiting. For the carnival. Why are we? Two hours later. <laughs> We're still here. We're still here. Raindrops keep falling on my head. Bom, bom, bom. <laughs> Don't know the rest of the words, but we will sing in the rain. We could do that. Singing in the rain. Singing in the rain. Glorious feeling, I'm half, half, happy again. <laughs> <laughs> Remix! Oh, yay! Oh, we're not here again. Oh, God, not again. I think he's going around the mill, that chap. Yeah. He cuts through the back. Yeah. Oh, yay! <laughs> oh, yay! Oh, no!
Well, what did we all think of that? Magical. <laughs> I think, personally, yeah. it puts Disney Parade to shame. Oh, really? Yeah, because maybe not the American one, because I haven't seen that in years, but the Paris one. Yeah, really? But the only thing I can think of why is probably Ooh, because they had to do that every single day twice, so yeah. they probably don't do as like. It's getting it already, isn't it? Yeah. Let's put that in your report. All those people were wet, cold. Oh my god, my camera, I'm surprised it still works. It was so wet. Look at that wet on there. Yeah. <laughs> it's completely <laughs> soaked. <laughs> but it was worth it. Well, my arm is more than the other. This will be the last time I am tucked up in my little white marshmallow bed. And the last time you will see Kate in her little marshmallow surroundings. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed that magical footage. That was easily one of the best carnivals I'd ever been to. Um, I'd like to know if you've ever been to one as magical as that and what you thought of that one we just saw because I have no words. I think I filmed every single float that went past but I don't know if I'm gonna put it put everyone in but I'll I'll put the wow. best ones in. Yeah it was two hours worth. Although I think if you put all the clips together yeah. it'll be like half hour. Okay. But now we need sleep because we're leaving tomorrow um and I think we need to get out by ten. Toodles for now, toodles to Kate because she's going home. <laughs> Good night <laughs> night. Wearing my taco top today. Boop, boop. <laughs> Royalty pass. <laughs> Turn this over. Pop it down. Fetch a plate. <laughs> Goodbye, 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 goodbye. <laughs> Thank you for having us. House, I don't know if we'll be back, but we left a little present for the owner. Isn't that cute of my little mummy? <clears throat> my mum basically cleaned the place brand new this morning too, <laughs> just to save the cleaners jobs. <laughs> Say goodbye to the house. Aww, bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get my phone and kiss my bedroom goodbye. 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 Good. Oh, it's nice and toasty up here. I have to turn down the heating. There's no point having that on when we're gone, is there? <laughs> I love those little radiators. I wish I had them at home where I could just turn up and down the heating. Does anyone get really paranoid when they stay somewhere and like look at everything a million times to double check whether? Have you forgotten anything? Is that just me? <sighs> I didn't really film the garden, so here's a little look at the garden. It's very cute and cosy, fairies live in there. They've got a little bench here. We didn't really use it because of the weather, but there was a massive tree down the end last time. And I think they chopped it down. Um, oh, yeah, very cosy. Very cosy and snug. And obviously there's a little gate down there. The automatic one we've been using every morning. So like this is all private area, obviously. And the owners of this place live here. Next door. So you can't have any rowdy house parties because they will tell you off. Can't lock this door now. Oh. I did it. It's been nice just to get away for a few days um, and just relax and just chill out in a really calming and relaxing place. I really like Glastonbury, it's filled with very unique people and unique things, like the shops there are very interesting and different and <laughs> I am very very excited to be back in my bed though, even though that bed was so comfortable. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Oh, I need to stretch. Hold on.
thank you very very much for watching this video um i hope you are enjoying my vlogs and i hope you enjoyed this vlog i absolutely love vlogging for you guys so let me know if you are enjoying this video and or if you had enjoyed this video and let me know what your favorite point of the glastonbury vlogs were i've also got one up that i posted yesterday so check that out thanks for watching guys and i will see ya tomorrow tomorrow i'm so sorry i keep you on see you tomorrow bye